Right now, we're trying to find out more about this Painesville mom who was deported back to Mexico. News 5 Sarah Finney is in the newsroom. And Sarah, still a lot of questions this morning. Well, in the last half hour, Terrence, we did get some answers. An Immigration and Customs Enforcement official confirms to me that Beatriz Morelos has been deported. He says there were no issues. She was taken to Nuevo Laredo, which is a border city that is very dangerous and violent. Morelos was discovered by ICE just over a week ago when she was arrested for driving without a license. The couple have four kids, all are U.S. citizens, and her husband has a visa. The plane dealer reports went down to Mexico to meet her. We don't know if they were able to reunite at this point, though. Morelos has lived in Painesville for 17 years. She and her family are members of St. Mary Church, and last night there was a vigil to pray for her. I don't want to imagine how difficult it would be for Beatrice to go back, leaving her children here in this land that promised something when she first came. I'm sure it was very difficult for her to leave everything behind to come here to try to have a better life. So why will she want to go back? And she is not alone. We're told seven members of St. Mary's have been deported in the last six months. Of course, other undocumented immigrants in that area tell us that they are very concerned watching this happen. Live in the newsroom, Sarah Finney, News 5. All right, Sarah, thank you.